What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess, High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my Christ subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Have suicide to ever, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 12,755 subscribers right now, so thanks so much for all the love and support. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot by the links in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo, if you feel guided to donate. Okay, so I received another channeling. They're just flying in today, so I'm going to do it. Um, by the way, um, before I deliver it, I just want to let you guys know, all of May of 2022's readings are up. They're all up. They're all caught up. Um, I have some of June's up as well, um, but all the maids are caught up. The Oracle card readings, they're all up, um, all signs. Just in 96, it's caught up, up until the 28th. Um, yeah, hold on, up until, yeah, up until 28th. Um, um. All of the hashtag glow ups are up for all signs for May and all of the truths hidden are up. And of course I did the day, daily tea. So everything's all caught up uh, for May. And everybody, you're welcome to uh, cross watch. You're welcome to uh, view your sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, whatever placements, cross watch, whatever. Okay. Um, I just wanted to make that announcement real quick. Okay. So the channel message I received was... Um, an Aries um, that has been practicing dark arts um, for a long time, it is about to finally energetically backfire on them, is what I heard. Um, some of these Aries, their teenager um, teenager is about to find out they're pregnant. For some of these Aries, their teenager has impregnated somebody. And for some of these Aries, they're a position of high authority and through many series of chain of events, um, regarding an investigation they will be terminated because of evidence um so you plug it in how it resonates dark arts wielding aries energy i feel they could be masculine or feminine aries energy they could have aries in their sun moon rising venus or they've been here jupiter charts if uh, hopefully it's not you um hope I, i'm feeling for a lot of you guys it's someone um you're connected to in some shape form or fashion for a lot of you guys um but you plug it in how it resonates if that resonates in your life it sounds like it's at least three aries in the universe um some of these aries their positions of high authority um in the universe in some shape form or fashion and it sounds like um an investigation is already going on or it's about to go on and through this investigation it sounds like they are going to end up being terminated because of the investigation and they are a position of high authority in some shape, form, or fashion in the universe. Um, in some shape, form, or fashion. That's the first one. The second one, um, the, and I just want to say for these two and three, they have to be older type Aries energies to have teenagers. Um, for example, I'm 38 years old and I have teenagers. So I don't feel it's like a 20-year-old Aries is what I'm saying. And I heard they've been practicing dark arts for a, a while. So they're well-versed in occultism um black magic dark arts they've done their research they've wielded it i mean they know what the hell they're doing so i'm feeling these people are probably 30s 40s 50s 60s is what i'm presuming here 30s 40s 50s 60s age range uh for these aries energies they i you ain't 20 years old have no damn teenager usually usually you're not freaking 20 years old having a teenager so i'm feeling 30s 40s 50s 60s maybe 70s um, you plug it in how it resonates, and I'm just being for real, for real. So that's the first one. The second one, um, this Aries has a teenage child, um, and I heard uh, their teenage child is going to end up pregnant. So that's how it's going to energetically boomerang on them for one of them. So it's a femme energy teenage child. If this resonates for them, and it sounds like um, they're about to find out their teenage child is pregnant, or the teenage femme child is about to find out she's pregnant for situation two. For situation three, it's a masculine, it sounds like a masculine teenage child, and they have impregnated somebody. Um, so like I said, I feel these Aries energies are 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, maybe 70s, possibly, for some of these people. And I'm serious, I don't feel there's no 20-year-old Aries. 
um, or 18 year old teeny bopper Aries. And I'm for real. Okay. So two of these Aries, they have teenagers. One, it sounds like a feminine energy teenager, one, a masculine energy. The fem energy teenager is about to end up pregnant. And that's how it's about to energetically boomerang back upon the Aries for one of them. For one, they have a masculine energy um, teenager and the masculine energy teenager is about to find out they've impregnated somebody is what I'm feeling here. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Holy crap, man. Spirit. Oh, hold on. Hold on, y'all. Your messages here I've reflected. Message of concern. Yes. About the, of, of teenage pregnancies. I mean, dear God. Message of concern. Teenage pregnancy energy is what I'm feeling here. And the investigation energy. Um, and probably, hey, this is the evidence we've collected in the, uh, in the investigation. We found out you were connected with it. Sorry, we have to let you go. But sorry, not sorry kind of energy. Um, I feel the message of concern can go with all three of these. They're about to receive a message of concern about the investigation or the results of the investigation, about um, the teenage daughter about to find out she's pregnant, and about the masculine energy teenage son about to find out he's impregnated somebody. Um, and it is his child. And it is his child is what I just heard. And it is his child. So this um, adult Aries black magic wielder energy, whoever this person is in the universe, hopefully not you, I'm thinking it's somebody you guys are connected to. I think they're going to question paternity with the masculine energy teenager son. I think they're going to try to question paternity. And for some of them, they're probably going to get paternity tests on the um, whoever this masculine energy teenager is impregnated. Um, and honestly, I would too. Um, just... CYA cover your ass. Um, I would too, just to make sure. But I heard it is his child. It is his child. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Message of concern for all three of these. Holy crap, man. Okay, I didn't hear anything. And one of these Aries, they have been getting money from a very rich masculine energy. And it's about to be cut off. Some it's prostitution services. Okay, and one of these Aries, they've been prostituting. They've been prostituting, uh, it sounds like with a very rich masculine energy. So this is a Fem Aries for number four. Um, now I feel she could be 20s, 30s. She could be probably maybe in her 20s for some of these Aries. But um, she could be 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s. I mean, hell, I don't know. Uh, I'm feeling probably younger Aries here, 20s, 30s, 40s, possibly. Um, she's been prostituting with a, I heard a very wealthy masculine energy, but I heard soon um, the services, He's. it sounds like he's about to deny her services and cut off the um, prostitution services, i.e. the money train. And so that could be the message of concern too for this black wielding um, Aries energy. She's obviously very attractive, I'll tell you that. I mean, because I mean, I would presume she's probably very attractive. I mean, who's going to pay for sex services for somebody that's not attractive? I wouldn't. I mean, I would never pay for sex services ever fucking a day in my life. Um, I've been offered to be, I've been offered to be paid sex services uh, for my sex services before. I've been offered money straight up. I've been offered a lot of money before for my sex services. Um, I've never done it. I've never been. I've never accepted the money for sex services because I believe you should, if you want to have sex with somebody, you shouldn't have to pay for me personally. So I would never accept money for sex services, but I've been offered before. I mean like thousands of dollars before, just for real, for real. 
but but this person they are they this black magic wielding aries they are and it sounds like they're getting a hell of a lot of money for sex services from a wealthy masculine energy i feel they like i said i feel they might be 20s 30s maybe 40s femme energy and um they um it's about to be cut off. So uh, the wealthy masculine energy is about to not be interested in her sex services. And so that's how it's about to boomerang back on one of the black magic wielding Aries. Message of concern. He's not going to want her sex services anymore. Um, and it's going to probably scare the hell out of her or piss her off because she's making it sounds like hella bank off of it. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates, man. Holy crap. Spirit messages you have reflected. Spirit messages you have reflected. Mature man. Message. Yeah, holy crap. We got message of concern and message in here. Number five, seven, or 14 can be very significant numbers in these Aries lives or your lives in some shape, form, or fashion. Five, seven, or 14. It could be possible ages of children of these Aries or a children of yours or um, any other significant number in some shape, form, or fashion. For some of these Aries, we have heavy teenage pregnancy energy in here. Maybe one of these Aries chi child, masculine or feminine child, the fem child is about to end up pregnant or the masculine that's about to impregnate somebody. Maybe they're 14 for some of them. I know 14 is kind of young. I have a 14 year old too. I would never want my 14 year old son knocking anybody up. I would hell to his no. But maybe for some of them, you plug it in how it resonates. We have 5, 7, 14. Mature man. A very mature masculine energy is about to become a very negative part of this of these Aries lives soon. Negative energy here, but this is a high vibrational masculine energy. These Aries are not going to like what he says. Okay, so you plug in and how it resonates. So, a mature masculine energy is about to become part of these Aries lives soon. Um, it's a high vibrational mature masculine energy. For some, you could be the high vibrational mature masculine energy, possibly if you resonate in these scenarios, possibly. Um, I heard um, these low vibrational Aries black magic wielders, um, I heard they're not they're not going to like what this mature masculine energy says. I feel in one of these cases, situation four over here, this mature masculine energy is the one that's been utilizing prostitution services from um, this attractive fem Aries energy. She has a very nice booty. She has a very nice booty is what I just heard. Holy shit. Whoa. Okay, so, well, shout out to the nice booties of us people. I got a nice booty too, honey. Just saying, but I don't go out and uh, have somebody pay thousands of dollars to tap that ass either. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. <laughs> she has a very nice booty, apparently. She has a nice buttocks, you guys. Uh, for anybody just, oh, shit. She has a nice booty. She's got a nice bottom. Nice gluteus maximus. Just saying, just saying, just saying. Whoever you are. Like I said, shout out to the big booty juice. But anyways, <laughs> um, he's but he's about to become very significant in these people's lives. Whoever, whatever situation resonates here, he's very high vibrational. Heard he's not gonna like, um, they're not gonna like what he says. So whoever this person is and how they're about to apply. I feel for some this could be the an investigator for the situation one, the position of authority is about to get terminated over an investigation. I think this is an investigator or investigators about to deliver the termination news to her or him, her or him. I didn't hear of some masculine feminine, her or him. Um, 
this might be um, the a father of um, one of the teenagers that's not the Aries child. It might be a father. It might be a doctor. It might be um, or something of that, that nature. I'm thinking a father or a doctor energy here. And this, I think, is the um, wealthy masculine energy that was paying for the sex services. That's exactly what I think. But you plug it in and it resonates. Wow, man. I mean, because we have mature man with a message of concern with message. Yeah, that's exactly the way I think it's going to uh, is here. Uh, for some, this could be the boss or investigator or investigators or HR, possibly. And like I said, I think this is a doctor or a parent of the other child that's pregnant or has been impregnated. And then I think this is wealthy masculine energy. It's been utilizing sex services. Holy crap, man. And then message. And we have sudden wealth under it. They're about to lose a lot of money. They're about to lose a lot of money. Just seriously. Uh, whether it's off the prostitution or another mouth to feed with a pregnancy and baby strollers to buy and baby cribs and blase, blase, blase. Or, um, determination here. Number 11 could be a very significant number in one's life as well. Number 11. Not good news. These Aries are go not going, they're not going to want to hear it. It's going to affect their money in a huge negative way. Okay. Heard not good news. These Aries are not go going to want to hear it. It's going to affect their money in a very negative way. So, um, yeah, message of, of some kind of investment loss or um, the pregnancy or money being taken away because the Masculine energy don't want the sex services anymore. And I do think he was paying her a shit ton of money. I'm just saying. Or the termination coming because of the investigation. And this is not like a wrongful termination. This is a rightful termination. So, I I mean, you and it's a position of high authority Aries. So, obviously, sudden wealth reversed. They, whatever job field or title they held, it was a high one. And I'm sure they got paid mega bank. So you plug it in, how it resonates, if that resonates for you. Or they do get paid mega bank. It sounds like it's upcoming in the universe. So they haven't got terminated yet, but it sounds like it's coming soon. One of these Aries is going to want to lash out at a particular feminine energy after this happens. But no, if you do and you try to go to her home, she will call the police and it will go very negatively for you. Oh my Lord, this is crazy. I heard one of these Aries, uh, after this happens, uh, whichever situation this occur, um, happens, you know, whichever situation they resonate in, um, I heard, um, and I feel one of you negative light side, uh, negative dark side, black magic wielders watches. And I'm just being for real, for real. At least one of you do. Um, I heard after um, the, whatever situation you resonate with here and how it's about to energetically boomerang back on your ass in whatever form it does here, um, I heard you're going to want to lash out at a particular feminine energy. But I heard just know um, she will end up, if you go to her home, it sounds like you're going to want to go to her home and start beefing drama and craziness with her. Um, like you're going to show up to her personal dwelling. But I heard if you do, she will call the police on you and it will go very badly for you. So that's a little message for one of you guys after this occurs in your life. And um, you want to lash out at whoever, whatever femme energy this is and however she applies in your life. Holy crap, man. All right. Well, I'm getting out of here. Love you guys. Namaste.